Ifuli is the truth. You gonna learn today. What is happening, YouTube? Y'all know me, Ifuli, aka the Golden Child, aka your mama's best friend, aka Mr. Believe It, bitch. Uh, sorry, it's taking me a minute to upload another video, but I've had a few requests, and this is one of the the top ones: the NCR Veteran Ranger Armor. I'm calling this the Rogue Set. Um. I'm not just going to be reviewing shit that I like, but also just shit in general that uh, people want to put on the channel, and this was one of them. Um, I'm going to tell you right off the top, man, I was very disappointed in this mod in particular, and I will go through it and show you why, and you guys, you know, comment down below and let me know what you think, but quite a few people have already downloaded this. Uh, it is a full set um, of armor. Uh, actually, it has two parts to it, I believe, so far. Um, it says version 3.0, so I don't know if it was a version 1 or 2. I know it was a version 2 because version 3, 3 came out right after I started putting mods on my Fallout. Uh, just a little quick look at the uh, description. Uh, can we make a power armor in 8 hours? Watch. Uh, okay. We bring... Okay, version 3.0, bring law and justice to the Commonwealth. With the riot gear. Okay, so the first set of armor, the Veteran Ranger, is, it says, uh, it's at Kellogg's place. If you look down in, in, in the paragraph, it's at Kellogg's place. The riot gear, however, if you look, keep reading under the, the Road to Liber Liberty paragraph, it's at Commonwealth Bank. Okay, I will show you where both locations are at. But let me tell you, the biggest dislike that just makes this shit unfun is that this motherfucker put them in specific places. Most mods, people already know, you can just craft them at the chem station. You know what I'm saying? No problem. Um, but this motherfucker, and I think this is the only mod that I, that I have that this nigga actually made you go on a scavenger hunt to get. And I did not understand it because you look at it, the... You want people to download your mods. You want people to view your shit so in case they view your PayPal, they can they can uh, donate and shit. This nigga put this shit... The Kellogg's place wasn't that bad. You know what I'm saying? I'll show you that shit that you should know because uh, you have to go through it through the storyline. But the Commonwealth Bank is not... If you are not very familiar with it, let's say you, you, you beat the game and you just went through the main storyline... You know what I'm saying? It's not a blip on your map. The Commonwealth Blank Bank is not a blip or a, a marker on your map. You have to literally find this place. And like I say, if you're not familiar with it, you'll never find this bitch. Like you would literally have to look this shit up. Um, and that's that's my biggest problem. Like nigga, why the fuck are you making us work to get your mod? Like why not just put it in a simple ass place? Hey, look at the dead body in in the in the room that you started. Shit like that, you know what I'm saying? But I'm gonna load this shit up. Uh, what else do I need to say about this? Um, and then another problem I had is it's not very descriptive with the riot gear. If you look down, it just says the riot gear can be found in Commonwealth Bank. That's it. I'm thinking, oh, I walk into Commonwealth Bank. I'm just gonna see the shit going in the fucking dark. Da 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 da. Riot gear. No, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Commonwealth Bank, you got to go up the elevator, hack some doors and shit. I'm like, what the fuck? And then I was looking through safes because the first set of armor is in a safe. It's in Kellogg's safe. So the second set, I'm thinking, okay, maybe it's in a... Let me just go ahead and show y'all the locations of both maps, and then we'll take a look at the armor. All right, you guys. So here is the Commonwealth Bank. I do have a pistol in my fucking hand. Um... Here is the bank. Uh, trying to look around so you can just see like landmarks. Because like I said, there is no blip on the radar. If you've never been here before. Um, just looking around at buildings. And I'm going to show you actually on the map. And as you see it, it's fucking stories high. Uh, and that's my main problem with this shit. Let's show you on the map where I'm at. 
uh, close to the lake or the ocean to the side. Um, if you have everything discovered, um, the Haymarket Hall is where I fast travel to. Um, another landmarks is the Hob Harbor Harbor Master Hotel, um, Postal Square, and it's like if you can look at the streets right here on the edge of this street. Um, and that's what I'm saying, man. It makes it so difficult. Like if you're a noob at the game or you just not very familiar with shit and you just kind of ran through this bitch, you would not be able to find this bitch. Like you would not, if you did not know where it's at, because Commonwealth to me is this whole area, you know what I'm saying? And it's like a bank, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, here we go. It's another bank over here. You know what I'm saying? And like I say, Commonwealth, if you look down in the corner, is fucking everything. So saying, oh, it's at Commonwealth Bank and not really giving a kind of where is that, you know what I'm saying? No description of when you get in the Commonwealth Bank, where the fuck to go. Just, hey, it's in Commonwealth Bank. Happy hunting, motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? That shit really pissed me off. And I mean, like, you want people to download your mod. You want people to use your mod, give you a good rating. I'm going to have to give this, like... A low fucking score because this shit right here like it's too much and there are other pieces of gear or other mods out there that's better you know what i'm saying it's not the best i'll tell you that much um but as far as on the map this is where the actual riot gear is when he said commonwealth bank this is what he was talking about okay we'll go inside i'll show you where it's at and that's what i was thinking it's like oh i'll come inside and it'll just be waiting for me somewhere now, uh um, buddy, get your ass on this motherfucking uh, elevator. Let's take a ride. All right, so you take the elevator, and trust me, still some more to go, nigga. So I was sitting up here looking around, like, shit, where is it at? Do I go through the door? I'm sitting up here just looking around, looking around, because this is the area back here. I was like, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? Then I saw this big ass door. You gotta unlock this shit, which is a master. And then I came in this bitch, I was like, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? So I hacked both of these, opened them hoes up, but the riot gear was sitting on this dead motherfucker right here. And it's not the, if you get the veteran ranger set, it's not, it doesn't have the mask. Um, all it has, the second set, Uh, riot gear and coat and the riot helmet the mask is still part of the veteran ranger set okay uh, and I'll show you where the uh, veteran ranger set is right now but that's really where it's at at the, the, the bank okay and I really have a problem with that I can't stress that enough uh, let's go look at the first set real quick. right you guys so when you come to Diamond City of course, you know the entrance. Kellogg's place is right over here in the corner. Up the steps. Everybody, god damn it, stop getting tired, bro. Everybody should know that shit because it's part of the storyline. Trying to make things quick for you guys. All right, when you come into this place, right here off to the side in this safe is where the veteran ranger gear is simple enough because he said kellogg's place when you come in this bitch uh, and i think he even said he had a video where the gear was at but the riot gear as you saw it doesn't show anything that video those videos that i went to to find the um riot gear none of that shit had the location of it at all um so let's show you the armor. I'm gonna actually go to a different place for that shit real quick. All right, you guys. So this is a look at just the straight up riot gear. Uh, like I said, the mask is the only thing that's not uh, different between the two sets. It's the same mask that you use. Um, but I mean, it's just the basic trench coat, uh, buffy shoulders, uh, helmet, just same regular fucking outfit. Um, 
Yeah. And let me put on the Veteran Ranger set real quick. And this is the Veteran Ranger set. Kind of looks the same almost. I mean, the ride gear just had better shoulders, bigger shoulders, and a different chest. But I mean, as far as the boots and everything, um, pretty much the same. And as far as the weapon that you get, uh, and that's how I knew when I went to the bank that this was the modded shit because the revolver that was in there, it said blue. Hey, what the fuck that was? But I knew it wasn't something you could just pick up in the, um, just off the street, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, it's just your typical pistol with your old Western uh, pistol, kind of like the pitcher um, with the scope on it, man. I'll probably take that scope off because I don't like that shit. But uh, the, the gun is probably the best part of it, man. I really like the gun, the fact that it's kind of like that old Western feel to it. Uh, but as far as the armor and everything, like I say, man, I would have to give... I'd have to give the armor. I mean, it's not the best by far, you know what I'm saying? Because it's just, I guess it's all up to your opinion. And in my opinion, it's just not that flashy or, you know, just over the top. It's like some gear you can pick up from around the way, you know what I'm saying? Uh, but I would give the gear just an A, you know what I'm saying? Not an A plus or A plus plus plus, you know what I'm saying? Um, but it, when you factor in what you have to do to get it, like I say, that big bank shit, that was the biggest turnoff, man. Uh, because you had kids having to try to find it. And that's how I found out about this mod was because a few people that messaged me was like, yeah, why don't you do this mod? And, you know, if you find the second set, let us know. And I didn't really understand what they were talking about until I tried to find it. Um, I don't think you should make motherfuckers go through loops to try to find your shit. And you, if it was simple enough, people wouldn't have tried to search to try to find it. Or, you know, YouTube or Google, the Commonwealth Bank and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but y'all comment down below. Y'all tell me what the fuck y'all think. Uh, normally, I would say, you know, go to the PayPal and go to the uh, founder's PayPal and, you know, donate 50 cents here, dollar there to help them out. But I think this developer needs to know, like, yo, you need to, you got some tweaks, buddy. Like, I don't understand why you can't put it in simple places under the under a marker that we can find the shit and then number two put it more descriptive if you're gonna hide it like that which i think is is hidden when it's upstairs behind a door almost in the safe type shit like you need to put more descriptive to the viewers to the people downloading it so they can find that shit with ease you see what i'm saying put that shit uh in the institution where the doctor is shit like that like okay you know exactly where the fuck to go you know what I mean? But that's just my opinion. I feel like it was just too difficult to find it. So I would give the location or how to get it. I would give that like the lowest grade ever, like F. You know what I'm saying? But all in all, I say overall, it's probably a B. Just a straight up B type mod. You know what I'm saying? Download it if you want to. Hopefully, y'all be able to find it a lot better with the help of this video. Other than that, make sure you rate, comment, and subscribe. If you got some mods you want your boy to check out, Please comment down below or send me a message on Xbox. Other than that, you fully running the game. If you don't believe that, suck by Wang. I'm out. Oh, you fully signing the fuck out. Spread the word, I'm back breaking, bitch.